we want to solve the quadratic equation 3x squared plus 18x plus 174 equals 0 using the quadratic formula. Let's go ahead and do this on the next slide where we have more room. The first step is to identify the values of a, b, and c which we'll use in the quadratic formula where a is the coefficient of x squared, so a equals 3. b is the coefficient of x, so b equals 18. And c is the constant term, and therefore c equals 174. And now we'll perform substitution into the quadratic formula. So we'll have x equals, and then we'd have negative b, which is negative 18, plus or minus the square root of b squared, that would be 18 squared, minus 4 times a, where a is 3, times c, where c is 174. All of this is divided by 2 times a, in this case, 2 times 3. Now let's begin to simplify. We'd have negative 18 plus or minus the square root of 18 squared minus 4 times 3 times 174. Let's find this value, which is called the discriminant on the calculator. So we'd have 18 squared minus 4 times 3 times 174. So the discriminant, or the radicand, is negative 1,764. Notice how because the radicand is negative, we know we're going to have two complex solutions. Our denominator is 2 times 3, which is 6. Now we want to simplify. Let's write this as negative 18 plus or minus the square root of, let's write negative 1,764 as 1,764 times negative 1 divided by 6. And let's check and see if 1,764 is a perfect square. If it is, this square root will simplify perfectly. So we'll enter second x squared for the square root, and then we have 1,764. Enter. Notice how this does simplify perfectly, so we should be able to recognize this will simplify to not just 42, but 42i, because we have the square root of negative 1 here. This calculator also does have complex mode, so another way to check this would be to press the mode key, make sure a plus bi is highlighted, which it is, Go back to the home screen, and we should be able to enter the square root of negative 1,764, and it should show us the 42i. So negative 1,764, enter, and notice how it does. So we have negative 18 plus or minus 42i divided by 6. Now we want to be careful simplifying here. We cannot just simplify the 18 and the 6. We want to separate this into two separate fractions and then simplify them separately. So we have x equals negative 18 divided by 6 plus or minus 42 divided by 6i. Well, negative 18 divided by 6 equals negative 3. So we have negative 3 plus or minus 42 divided by 6 equals 7, so we have plus or minus 7i. Now in the homework, we do enter these separately. Our first solution, x sub 1, is going to be equal to negative 3 minus 7i, and our second solution will be x sub 2 equals negative 3 plus 7i. So going back to the previous slide, we have negative 3 minus 7i, which would come from the quadratic formula here where we have minus and x sub 2 equals negative 3 plus 7i, where in the quadratic formula we have a plus sign here. I hope you found this helpful.